well, this is your London debut on Tuesday, the 23rd, tomorrow. How are you feeling about that? Are you nervous or are you excited? I'm a bit uh, jet-lagged now, but <laughs> I'm very excited, yes. Cool, and obviously you live in New York. I mean, what's your favourite part of New York? Oh, New York is so attractive. I mean, I lived in New York for 20 years, 20 years. Um, but I always discover something new every every month, every day. I discover something new, and that's the that's the attraction of New York. A traditional Korean music is definitely not uh, what's so called K-pop mm -hmm. nowadays. Traditional Korean music is based on um, very deep pathos. Mm -hmm. So they have a lot of. The words are very melismatic, and um, the music uh, is very complicated. Mm -hmm. And um, for example, when we talk about sadness, I cannot swim in the sadness. I have to be distant from my own sadness to be able to see the sadness, observe the sadness, without being plunged into it. So that's the difference of how you play Korean traditional music and to play Western music. That's a very important thing to acknowledge, I think. Mm. Music is definitely very powerful. Absolutely. And um, people don't realize how important it is because uh, it's clearly it's clearly not an entertainment. It's it's has a role in society, and as artists, we have a role in society. And without music, the life is too dreadful, I 